18 months. Okay, for those who are not familiar with Chinese medicine, maybe I'll, I have a little bit of background about what's yin and what's yang. So, Chinese herbs for promoting health could be divided into two categories, yin and yang. So, we hypothesize that the yang herbs can stimulate the ATP generation in the mitochondria and thereby produce more ROS, okay, at the same time. And it is this ROS, reactive oxygen species, which can upregulate the mitochondrial antioxidant defense. So this is our hypothesis. So the hypothesis was tested by experimental investigation. We first test different yang invigorating herbs and also the yin nourishing herbs in the animal model. Okay, we fit the extract, herbal extract in the mice and then test the mitochondrial, uh, mitochondrial, mitochondrial ATP generation capacity. And we can see that most of the yang invigorating herbs can stimulate mitochondrial ATP generation a lot the yin herbs. We also test the yin invigorating herbal extract in a cell-based model. Uh, we also have been able to demonstrate that the extract can stimulate ATP generation uh, in the H9C2 cardiomyocytes. So that support our hypothesis that yin invigorating herbs could stimulate ATP generation in the mitochondria. So how about the antioxidant capacity in the mitochondria? So we first test the hypothesis by investigating a yang invigorating Chinese herbal formula, formula called VI28. So we feed the animal with the herb for a long period of time, about 30 doses in uh, six months. And then we examine the mitochondrial uh, AT, uh, antioxidant status in different tissue, brain to skeletal So we have been able to show that with the uh, fitting of the VI28, so the mitochondrial antioxidant components in different tissue increase and in both male and female mice. And this finding has been uh, published earlier in the tubulation research. And the enhanced in the mitochondrial antioxidant status was evidenced by the decrease in the mitochondrial RS production in various tissue. Then we further look into whether the VI28, this Chinese uh, yang in liquidated herbal formula can protect the tissue against oxidative stress induced injuries. So the brain, kidney, heart, and liver, we use different uh, stress model. For example, the brain, we use uh, ischemia reperfusion. Kidney, we use uh, the uh, gentamicin induced kidney injury. Heart, we use myocardial ischemia reperfusion injury. Liver, we just use the carbon tetrachloride hepatotoxicity. toxicity. So in all this model, VI28P treatment, Low dose for a long time has been shown to be able to protect against this oxidative uh, stress induced tissue injury. Okay, now we know the mitochondrial decay theory of aging. Okay, how about uh, then we want to examine whether the VI28 could actually enhance the survival in aging mice. Then we supplement the diet of the mice with the VI28 at different concentration, 0.5% and 0.5%, starting from the age of 36 weeks. So in the male mice, we can see there's an enhanced increase, significant increase in the median lifespan when compared with the control in 
uh, both doses, okay, even though there's no, no dose dependent effect. And for the female mice, for the low dose, 0.05%, uh, there's a significant increase in the median lifespan. And however, for the high dose, there's a marginal, only a marginal increase in the median lifespan. So the effect is not as good as in the uh, male mice. So we find that the enhancement in the survival is not due to the change or the, uh, say, the uh, slowdown of the growing rate of the mites because we did not see any change in the body weight after fitting, or at least did not see a decrease in body weight after the fitting uh, with the uh, VI28, this yeah, uh, invigorating child survival formula. So it's not probably the survival enhancement effect is not probably due to the, uh, <coughs> for example, the caloric restriction. So, instead of due to the decrease in food intake, so the enhancement in survival is likely due to the, say, the enhancement of the mitochondrial antioxidant status. And we look at the time-dependent changes in the mitochondrial antioxidant status, in, as well as the functional ability in various organs. Due to the limitation of time, just look at the brain, okay? There's a progressive decrease in the glutathione content in the mitochondria in the brain during aging. And the VI28 supplementation is able to sustain this mitochondrial glutathione level up to the age of 72 weeks, both male and female with the effect on the male being more common. So let's look at the functional ability, that is the ATP generation capacity of the mitochondria. So there's also a progressive decrease in the mitochondrial ATP generation capacity in both male and female mice. And with the VI28 supplementation, has been able to uh, sustain this ATP generation capacity to a certain extent. So in conclusion, so we have been able to show that a long-term dietary supplementation with a young invigorating herbal formula increased the median lifespan of male and female mice. And also the survival enhancement was associated with <coughs> the mitigation of age-dependent declines in mitochondrial antioxidant capacity and functional ability in mice. And also the retardation of the mitochondrial decay at younger age was associated with a later survival enhancement. As we look back to the survival curve, the biggest difference between the, uh, the, or the biggest decrease in the uh, survival rate in male and female mice is around 80 to 120 weeks. Okay, there's a deep increase in the deep decline in survival rate, but with the VI28 supplementation, uh, the survival rate decreased. So we suspect that this decrease, significant decrease in survival, uh, enhancement in survival rate during that period of time is due to the, the precedent enhancement of the mitochondrial antioxidant status. So in connection with this mitochondrial Masses theory. So we suggested that the yang invigorating Chinese herbal formula could actually uh, serve as a mitochromatic agent to enhance the mitochondrial structural and functional integrity and therefore offer a prospect of longer survival. Thank you.